Hey everybody, Jason here. So, I'm heading out to the bush camp. So, yeah, most of you will know that the last time I was out to the camp, I found that it had been damaged. And, uh, you know, my assumption, my figuring is that it was vandalized, but a lot of people commented whether or not it was, but had uh, suggestions that maybe the weather damaged it, or maybe uh, a bear or Sasquatch. Um, and you know all cool and everything you know everyone's entitled to their opinion um i'm gonna stick to mine that somebody damaged it uh, but anyway that's behind me now it's time to rebuild it's just popping in my mind right now i had a lot of questions as well comments about whether it's public land or private land this is private land i have the permission to be here and uh, build a camp uh, I do believe in leave no trace and try as much as I can uh, but like I said this is private land and permission to build a camp uh, no permission to cut down living trees um, and yeah as I explained it I just uh, have as little impact as possible now I'm gonna also say it's hunting season uh, I don't have a vest I should have a vest on uh, it's posted no trespassing but all the same I know people do wander through from time to time and I hear gunshots from time to time so uh, yeah I'm gonna have to keep my eye out and if I notice any orange vests then I'm gonna have to make sure that I keep my head down but yeah anyway gonna get the fire pit going
Okay, let me tell you what's going on here. So basically I've got the fire pit left from last year. That's good. Some of the rocks were out of place and I've moved them back to where they should be-ish. Um, I'm gonna have to spend more time on that later. Uh, last year I had a, a fire reflector and it was horizontal. Anyhow, so what I'm doing this year is I'm gonna I'm building up vertically right now. And what I've done is, what is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, right now across. Um, I'm nowhere near finished, but I just thought I'd explain it right now. I had to start to lash them together. And so I figured just take this moment to explain uh, for those of you who are right now thinking, oh, that's useless. So the plan is I'm gonna continue building out uh, vertically and I'm gonna go over I'm probably gonna add one or two more poles on that side I might add one more on this side then I'm gonna come out on the other side and build a wall coming forward uh, from there I've left well a boot width between the fire pit and the reflector wall I'm gonna get more rocks as many as I can and I'm gonna stack them up between the fire and the wood. So I don't know how high I'll be able to stack it up. You know, I might, I don't know. I don't know how many rocks I'll be able to find or anything like that, but the plan is to uh, try to build it up as high as I can on those two sides around. Um, that'll create, you know, a lot more of that, uh, that radiant heat once the fire is going and be a much better uh, fire reflector the reflector wall comes out I might start the shelter right there so that I have basically you know like a C or a U shape where the fire is within it and my shelter is on one side and then basically I would sit on this side and you know be able to crawl onto the shelter to sleep at night I heard a noise that sounded like an animal you know running for its life so I'm a little bit concerned that there's some hunting going on back here that I don't know of so the next thing I'm gonna do is just I'm gonna put a couple angle stakes running from the top of this uh, this I guess ridge pole that they're lashed to and I'm gonna just angle down at the back so that way you know that way it won't fall down backwards I guess it could fall forward but I think the likelihood is slim once it's all in place I also uh, buried the base a little bit probably six inches uh, it could have gone further but was getting a lot of roots and it was just kind of difficult yeah I'll just keep at it Okay, well, I got the, I don't know, first wall done. Not really. Got a quarter of it finished. Um, but, yeah, my spidey senses are tingling, so I'm going to get out of here. It's getting late. This is actually the hour perfect to get out and hunt. Um, sun sets in about an hour from now, and... Yeah, I just, uh, yeah, got this feeling. I keep looking around. I keep hearing things and looking around. I don't know if it's just paranoia or what, but it is the season. It's rifle season right now. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to get out while the getting's good. Really, it's, uh, like I said, it's uh, sunset in an hour. I did pack some food um, and was thinking about having dinner out here, but, yeah. 
I don't think that's a good idea. So I'm gonna come back out in a day or two. Hopefully the weather's good.